how to backup and restore outlook emails okay i'm going to show you how you can backup your outlook emails and how you can restore it if you want so uh, guys i'm going to show you in this video tutorial so let's start with the video before we start i request you to like this video hit the like button subscribe my channel and don't forget comments below okay so there is there are server uh, method that you can use to backup your you know outlook emails so first is that you can export your outlook emails in PHP file and you can uh, restore it uh, whenever you want and second you can archive the emails it will be auto archive or manual archive so auto archive it is very useful so you can see it the auto archive as per your requirements and your old emails will be automatically auto archive in your PHP file and you can save it PHP file you can backup this PHP file easily so I'm going to show you first method that <coughs> you can export the, your uh, mailbox or emails from mailbox to php file and how you can restore so just go to the file okay and go to the open and export go to the impose export so this window will be open so now we need to export the file just click on export the file choose the php format only just click on next now choose the mailbox which you want to export so in my case i have three mailbox here i have three email account here which i have add to my account this is my default account okay so I want to export or backup this account so I have to click on it and just click on include subfolder so it will be uh, backup all folders within this uh, mailbox okay you can also create filters if you want this is diff setting you can change it or you can set it so now click on next now you can see this is PHP file has been created so personal folder backups so uh, this is my existing PHP file so all backup will be saved this um, PHP file so I want to change it so go to the browse and I want to change it with another folder I just rename it to only so it will be create another backup okay so it is two now here you can see three options where you can uh, select to replace duplicate with the item exported allow the duplicates item to be created and do not export duplicate item so whatever you want just select it just finished you can set the password it will be very uh, useful and it is like whenever you lost your PHP file or if you get another one uh, other person your PHP, PHP file so without password it will it uh, he or she won't be export or you know restore your PHP file so it is very uh, important to set the password so just set the password and you can click ok so if you don't want to set the password just click on ok only then your file will be export ok so PST files has been export it is done if you want to use again so how you can use it you have to export restore it uh, there is a two method you can restore from here ok go to the export import and you can import from another files and PST file now you have to select the file from so I just save in here this PST file too and you can import it okay so it is import to your mailbox okay but if you want to import in the another uh, PST file like this it will like offline folder okay so I can import go to the file open export now go to the open and data files and select that file which you have backup this one so when you click in this file will be open here okay you will see this file here it will take some some time okay so I have already backup this file or folder in same another name so maybe here it will be not backup it but definitely in your case it will be show here you can close your outlook and open open it it will be show your hundred percent so this is the first method and second method you can go to the option and go to the advanced and here you can see the auto archive the auto archive very useful to save your uh, you know uh, old email to particular PHP file okay so here you can see auto archive run every 17 days you can get the notification before auto archive you can archive the old items you can show the archive folder in the folder list this it means it will be show here okay so after 70 days it will be run uh, whatever you selected days and after archive it, the folder will be show here okay so clean out the older item you can also set the clean out the older items you set the month and move to the old items okay you can see the old item will be moved to this PHP file so this PHP file you have you can create new PHP file here any folders or you can okay I just create new PHP file 
and it will be open here and just click on ok so this also will show here and it is take time because we selected 17 days it will be run after 70 days and it will be saved here only okay so that is how you can use you can back up your outlook emails in your computer so guys i hope you like this video please subscribe me thank you for watching